Thousands of St. Lucians have begun receiving the promised income support from the government of St. Lucia, which forms part of the Social Stabilization Plan. The plan, announced by Prime Minister Honorable Alan Chastney, provides support to St. Lucians who are non-contributors to the National Insurance Corporation, but have lost their livelihood or income as a result of the COVID-19 pandemic. The government approved over $20 million to support these sole traders and self-employed St. Lucians in their time of need as part of the national response to the COVID-19 pandemic. As citizens receive their direct deposits and checks for $1,500 this week, it was quite an emotional and joyous day for some as they explain how the funds would assist them and their families. I'm just grateful for the help because at this present time in our, in our operation, things has really not been good from, I think it was from late February, I have not been working. I have not drive a dime. So to get this little help, as small as it is, I am grateful. I'm very grateful to, to, to government for coming up with such, a, such idea. And I believe everybody who is a recipient today should express a, a measure of gratitude for, for that small help. As small as it is, it is very, very important and it is very good. At least we can cover a little hole. Yeah, and I, I'm very grateful for it. I'm very happy to finally have it because, as you know, things are a little tight and I'll be able to pay some bills and eat some food, basically. Well, the process was a long one. I mean, a lot of us thought we were going to get it, you know, before, and then but now that it's here, it's here, so make best use of it. It was a promise and they deliver, so, it's, uh, I feel good. Mm -hmm. Oh, you know, our daily necessity, you know, it, it's small, but, you know, it, it helps. I am so elated, I use a very high word, mm -hmm. and, and so happy and grateful it will go a very long way. That's why I'm so proud to show off my check from my government. I thank you. And I hope all other vendors get their little check as well, especially the people with children and the elder folks. Oh, it will go such a long way. I'm a vendor and I really do need it. And I appreciate. I also have my rent to pay. I'm so grateful. I prayed for it and I thank God. The government of St. Lucia also took the decision to extend the deadline for the applications in order to reach more people adversely affected by COVID-19. The new deadline for applications for the income support program for non-NIC contributors is July 30th, 2020. Director of Implementation, Mrs. Nancy Charles, was on hand to explain how the program has been going so far. The government, as part of its social stabilization program, uh, made available $24 million to self-employed persons. So most of our persons who have been impacted by COVID, our vendors, taxi drivers, jet ski operators, um, we have persons from various backgrounds um, that we are providing that support to. Um, the first set of payments um, went out last week to persons who gave their bank accounts and as we indicated, check payments now are being made today at the Castro City Council um, for the first batch of about a hundred, a little over a hundred of them, so we're making check payments to them today. We had a lot of internal issues to sort out. Additionally, we had to wait for the passage of the appropriation bill. Um, we also had some challenges with the bank account numbers and the reconciliation with the banks, but finally it is here. So from last week, we have quite a few taxi drivers and vendors and other persons who receive payments via the bank. And today we have another batch of persons who are receiving payments. It will be um, a continuous process. So we have another batch being processed this week via the bank. And hopefully next week, those who will be getting check payments, we will resume the payments right here at CCC at a date and time that we will be giving to those persons. Applications must be electronically completed on the Government of St. Lucia website, www.govt.lc, and may be accessed from a computer or mobile phone. St. Lucians are reminded to put in the correct information, their account numbers, and all relevant banking information when filling out the form to speed up the process. The government of St. Lucia remains committed to ensuring St. Lucians receive support during this crisis. 
Reporting for the Office of the Prime Minister, I am Nicole MacDonald.